everybody, I'm Jason O'Dell, and uh, today there were some new firmware updates that just came out for the Nikon Z6 and Z7 uh, mirrorless cameras. Here's my Z6, and so today I want to show you how you can update the firmware if you haven't done so already. It's pretty simple. So what you're going to need for this is you're going to need your, your camera and make sure you've got a, a, a freshly charged battery in your camera. You're going to need a XQD card, a memory card for your Z6 or Z7. And I always format this memory card before I do anything so it's clean. And then you're going to need a card reader to attach the card to your computer. So with all of that in mind, let's go and download the firmware for the Nikon Z6 or Z7. So I'm online and you can go to your, your Nikon regional website. So I'm at Nikon USA because I'm here in the USA. And you want to go to the download center. It's um, actually under the product support area. You go to the download center. And once you're in the download center, you want to click mirrorless cameras right here and choose the Z series and then pick your product. So we go to the Z6 and then click firmware. And you can see here are the latest firmware versions. And this version, firmware version 2.10 just came out on November 21st, 2019. So that's the newest one. And you can click here, view download page. And you can choose your operating system. It'll tell you the changes. So here are all the changes in this firmware update. And in this one, we've added some lens support and worked out some bugs and made some minor tweaks to the operation of the camera. So you'll want to do that. Go down to the bottom, accept the license agreement, and then click download. And for Macs, that's a DMG, a disk image file, and um, you'll get the, the file. Now, once you've downloaded the file, or files as the case may be, you can go over to your downloads and there they are. So I've got both in this particular case. I've got the one for the Z6 and one for the Z7. So these are mountable disk images. I double click on one and it will open and it mounts on my computer as if it was a removable drive. And in here you see the folder called Z6 update. There it is. Make it big. Okay, so for the next part, what I want to do is I'm going to take this memory card, this XQD card, and I'm going to put it into my card reader. And that's going to bring it up onto my desktop. It will mount on the computer. And, and I can do this if I, let's see, make a new finder window. And right here is the Nikon Z6. So this is the memory card that I'm looking at in this window over here. Oops. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to open the Z6 update folder and there's this dot bin file, a binary. And you just want to drag and drop it right into the root directory level on your memory card. Okay, so this in my case says Nikon Z6 because it was formatted. If it says it may say untitled, but this is what you want to do. And at that point, I'm going to go ahead and eject the memory card from my computer by clicking the eject button. Okay, and we can close up all these other things. And now that it's ejected, I can remove the card safely from the reader. All right, I'm going to put the card into my Nikon Z6. And I'm going to power up the camera. And press the menu button. OK. And what you want to do is you want to go to the setup menu. That's the little wrench. And if you're at the top menu of the it, firmware update is the last item. So I'm actually going to toggle up one from where it says format memory card. And you'll see an item that says firmware version. That's what you're looking for, firmware version. And you click on that. And it will tell you the current version in your in your camera. It'll do this either way. But if you've successfully copied that dot bin file, that binary file, onto your memory card, you should have this option for update. And if you see that, that means you've done it right. You click update. Oh, it tells me my battery is low. So, duh, Jason, let's put in a fresh battery. OK. My battery is not really that low, but it's low enough. So I'm going to grab a fresh battery.
Okay, I've installed an, a fresh full battery. Go update firmware, and then you should get this little option here where it says, do you want to update from the current 2.01 to the new one 2.10? Yes, and you click OK. Press the button, and now it's going to just say updating, and this takes a little while. So you just let this run, and it says do not turn the camera off. You just do not mess with it, do not taunt it. I just set it down. So once that's complete, you can then go back and check your firmware update. Okay, it's been a couple of minutes, but now our update has completed and it's telling me to turn the camera off. So I'm going to turn the camera off right there. And now I'm going to turn it back on again. Go to my menu, go back to firmware version. And now it says it should say 2.10. So you're all set. At that point, you can reformat your memory card, um, do whatever you want. But that's how you update the firmware in the Nikon Z cameras, the Z6 or the Z7, and the current firmware is, uh, as of November 21st, 2019, is 2.10. So I always recommend going ahead and doing that um, just for uh, completeness sake. Okay, until next time, I'm Jason O'Dell. Thanks for joining me, and be sure to check out my website at luminescentphoto.com. Thank you.